very confident price movement finally we played out perfectly from the macd and we profit guys the position has been closed with a profit guys we got almost three thousand dollars on our balance The first position has been closed uh, at loose and the second one in profits. Greetings fellow traders, my name is Ted Trader and I'm here to guide you through the world of binary options trading. I'll be sharing the most effective and profitable strategies to help you succeed. If you're new to this scene and lack experience, join to my closer telegram groups where I provide a free signals with a 90% accuracy rate. Social trading is also an option perfect for those who have limited time and can't constantly monitor their trades. Simply copy my moves and make profitable deals without needing to be at your computer or phone. Don't forget to watch video in full, hit the subscribe button, like and leave a comment. By doing so, you'll be automatically interned into $300 Joe, where 3 lucky subscribers will each win $100 from me. Let's begin our journey together and make some profits. Uh, so guys, let's start our training session. Uh, today we got $510 on our balance right now. Um, the currency pairs are already picked out uh, and today we'll try to make from 3 to four thousand dollars and therefore we'll make a withdrawal uh, we'll start with two hundred fifty dollar trades and i want to keep a small margin in case uh, the trade ends up at loose however it doesn't happen often so our first target is one thousand dollars and then we can make a good amount of profit uh, let's peek our, at our trade indicators. The first one is going to be the Keltner channel and the second is the MACD. Um, uh, we're going to play on a one minute time frame, that's why we set fast period 6 and the slow period uh, 13. Uh, there we go. The main indicator will be the Keltner channel. Mostly we're going to uh, look at this one and the MACD signals will be complementary and then change our signal. Uh, we're gonna play from moving averages. You shouldn't forget about this indicator. It's very good uh, And I'm okay with the uh, histogram and let's start our training session and find the most promising currency pair for a good trade entry guys Whew. for using uh, MACD uh, there is gonna be a good uh, trend we got to see the trend clearly uh, and let's do that now set uh, the daily chart uh, so and basically we see a good trends without flats so and let's analyze uh, so there are good directions everywhere here the flat uh, takes place and there is nothing to do um, set a minute chart so and let's look for the better one Let's open a short position here guys, so we focus on the MACD on the first place. And, uh, we see that there we the downtrend before and I'm gonna show you guys up to the to what uh, point I mean it. Uh, then the price movement started going up, low volatility movement, but still it goes uh, to the upside. 
Um, I think there is a small correction takes place and the price started going down from this resistance level according to the Kelvin. And the um, MACD indicator is the bars of histogram painted red. Uh, the crossing from this above has happened and they tell us the price movement is going down, that's why we open the short position, guys. And as you can uh, see, the price is moving downwards exactly as I told you guys. And the position is important. Uh, more than $200 and we got uh, $723 on our balance. Uh, let's put down $350 at the trade amount and find the next currency player for the most uh, profitable trade entry. So let's take a look. Uh, here we open a long position. Uh, we already detected the, the entry point. Crossing of the moving averages did happen. Uh, that indicates the growth um, we see the MACD is uh, gonna uh, go to, is gonna go to the upside. Also, update of the bottom points that happen, and we see the breaking down from the inner channel to the outside, and then we are likely to see the pullback and the price movement should enter the channel again. That's why we open the long position. Now we see the candle's low volatility. This candle is also gonna be green and the position should be closed in profits, guys. So let's, let's just watch. There are 10 seconds left before the closing. And the position has been closed with a profit. We got $1,000 on our balance and let's refresh the page. The page was refreshed and let's open a 1000 trade and find the better currency pair. Uh, of course, I'd rather focus more on the MACD. Uh, but um, there is a really very movement takes place. That's why the Keltner channel is more helpful in this particular situation. Uh, so here we see the ascending price direction. But I guess we better open a short position here. Because we see here the histogram painted red on the MACD indicator and I think the price will go lower because uh, the resistance zone played um, out here. Early on uh, there was uptrend and this likely to be a correction in this zone. And I think uh, the price will go to the downside because the crossing from above has happened in this zone. Uh, look, uh, here we could uh, uh, of opening along after the crossing uh, C and the price starting going up. Uh, here the crossing is going uh, the top down, that's why we open a long position, guys. There are literally 10 seconds left before the climax and I think the trade is gonna be in profit. Very confident price movement. Finally, we played out perfectly from the MACD and we profited, guys. We almost uh, $2,000 on our balance. Uh, there is no stopping here. Uh, there are two thousand dollars more to go. I think we need two or three trades in order to achieve uh, our goal. Um. Let's open a long position here, guys. I think uh, in this case the chart has some direction. Uh, early uh, on there with a flat and as the MACD is not gonna show us anything good uh, we see nothing but crossing but the Keltner channel is helping us out here we see the breakout then uh, a descent pullback good correction touching uh, the channel upper border and uh, I get 
uh, further we're likely to see the price going up that's why we open the long positions uh, there are literally 20 seconds left and i think the breakout should happen on the last seconds and the position will end up in profit so let's just watch The position has been closer to the profit, guys. We got almost $3,000 on our balance, and I think we open a final position and make a good profit. And let's choose a currency pair. So, let's see. Uh, we need to open a final trade, guys. Uh, so, here we see the crossing of the maximum points. Um, so here the flat I'm in two minds so if we should open here uh, theoretically okay let's hold off and check our other currency pairs I think we should open a long position I'll explain the principle of trade entry guys the crossing of the MACD from um, above to place here and also the moving averages, the histogram of E facing upwards, updating of the maximum points uh, has happened. The support zone played out here. Also, we see the correction from this zone into the outer channel movement according to the Keltner. And according uh, to all this, the price uh, should go to the upside and we open uh, two long positions here. I think uh, we should expect the breakout on the last seconds and our position will end up in profit, guys. Oh, there are literally 10 seconds left. The first position has been closed uh, at loose and the second one in profits. So like I said, the first position is at loose, uh, the, second, the second one is in profit. I'll, I'll watch it, the situation on the market and I don't want to open the trade now, there is a flag. Let's change the currency pair and find uh, the better trade entry. Um, here we see the strong movement to the downside and let's hold off opening here. Here is flat, opening here is also a bad idea. Uh, so let's take a look at here. Uh, we open two short positions, guys. I'll explain the principle of trade entry. Uh, here we see the histogram painted red and see the reversal of the MACD. Uh, in this case, we look at more of the Keltner. Here's a breakdown that happened. We see uh, some kind of flag, uh, but the price movement is more downward as we saw before. Uh, then we see the pullback up to the inner channel part of the indicator. This zone has played out as the price should go to the downside, guys, exactly as it guys. Uh, it looks like the trend uh, gets downward direction and our position should be closed uh, with a profit. Yes, guys, our position has have been closed with a profit. Uh, we got $4,380 on our balance, uh, that's the outcome we got today, uh, with the help of these indicators, if you're interested, then uh, try them yourself. And let's move to the withdrawal, write down $4,000 uh, Bitcoin address, press the continue button, that is it. Our withdrawal is processing, there are $380 left on our balance and I course I'll attach the screens when it's done. Uh, thanks for watching guys, subscribe to my YouTube channel, put the like button, leave a comment down below. See you soon. Bye bye traders.